You know what? I hope using such weapons as this is not some sort of war crime here. Oh! What the? Oh my god. Oh, take his med help. Yeah, I'm going to get in some trouble for that, aren't I? Look, it was a gunship, okay? It seemed like the appropriate response. On reflection, perhaps it was a little less appropriate than I thought. Seeing as this is a populated area. Yeah. I mean, it's very effective at taking down things like gunships. But I suppose it's probably very effective at taking down everything in the vicinity of a gunship, too. So, yeah. All right. Lesson learned. Although I'm not totally sure a rocket launcher would be much. But it would be a little better, wouldn't it? It would be a little better. It is true. It was a gunship. It was a gunship, and that did make short work of it. So, maybe you could argue we did less damage. I mean, the gunship would have been spraying bullets everywhere. So, in that regards, maybe we were being sensible. Yes. We were being sensible. That's our story. And we're sticking with it. Shipping Manifest. This looks like a shipping manifest. It shows the Pitney 4 sold 2,000 units of Minigen X3 to the Eclipse, along with 600 units of red sand. This isn't the information Samara needs, but it proves that the Volus is a criminal. Valuable information to the Volus. Yeah, and to the police officer. We gotta keep moving. Who is probably, you know, going to be annoyed to find out what he's dealing in. As am I. And I mean, we could make it worse for him and just tell Samara. I... What? Is this him? It's him. I am a biotic god. I think things, and they happen. Fear me, lesser creatures, for I am biotics made flesh. Get, get, dude, you're high. I don't know what drugs you're on, but stay back and I won't shoot you. You will regret your It's not the same words. guy. It's not the same guy. I am a great wind that will sweep all before me like a... A great wind. A great biotic wind. Yes, you are. You are very windy. Yes, the Asari injecting so many drugs into me was terrifying. But then I began to smell my greatness. Yeah. They may laugh when I fall over, but they don't know what I know in my head. That I know that I am amazingly powerful. Fear me! Totally. Where did you come from? And please don't give me the mommy daddy speech. Are you part of Pitney Four's trade group? When I was mortal, I worked for Pitney. Poor soul is probably terrified that I have not returned. I doubt that. Don't think he's reported anything. Face it, Pitney will pick money over friends every time. Bah! I will wreak a just revenge upon his people. But first, the leader of these mercenaries is in the next room. I shall toss Wasaya about like a ragdoll. Um... This idiot is no challenge to anyone. Agreed. I will tear her apart. My biotics are unstoppable. 
we're right behind you. No, 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 no. You go take a nap. Wasea will tear you apart. Take a nap. You'll feel better. Are you mad? I'm unstoppable. Feasting on her biotic rich blood will be the last step. But great wind. Biotic god. I'm. I. What was I saying? I'm tired. Yes, very tired. You may be right. Yes, I'm tired. I'll nap. Destroy the universe later. Definitely. It'll still be here. Useless. I don't know. I kind of liked him. <laughs> it just... Okay. Right. Let's... What was the name? Wasi... Wasi? I'm guessing that's you. Everything's gone to hell since we smuggled that filthy creature off-world. All right. First a Justicar shows up. Now you. At least I can take pleasure in turning your head into a pulpy mass. Okay. Someone else is probably a little high as well. I'm gonna... Right, let's have a look. We've got... Multiple. Okay. Right, again, I, I'm just going to destroy these where they are so she can't send them in our general direction. I'll put them down. Did, I don't think you did. All right. We'll just take them out a little bit, weaken the opposition. Oh, the what? The, was that? Whoa, she's really high on that stuff. We are. Okay. All right, we have got to be careful. We have got to be careful. Why am I using that one? Because I have no ammo in the other one. Right. You see any ammo? Stay down. Okay. You two can get there for now. I see ammo. I see ammo. I see ammo. I hear something. Some, no, do not. What are you doing? Do not. Whatever it is, do it. All right. Where is she? Okay. You two. Got it. Take up position. Uh, is that? No, that's not her. Okay. Okay. All right. She's there. So, take that one out. Okay. They are weakened. I know it's probably bad strengthening her biotics. I just don't want that stuff sent in our direction. Last thing I want is to be high as a kite right now. Even though it does sound sort of nice. All right. Let the fire do it. Thing. And also, when it is Garrus, how are you? Garrus, how are you down? Get over there! Right. She's still got a barrier. Let's just focus on that one. Nice. All right, I think we got. Oh, what the? They came from. But. Okay. No, what you no what the hell is that? What did they come from? Get it, get it, all of you. What the I'm on it. Oh never mind, I found out where they're coming from. Okay. Nice repositioning. Oh we got more of them. Okay. Okay, right, that explains 
a what? No, again, again. How many of them are there? All right, we got to get in there to take out. That's not what I wanted to do. I want to make sure I got that. Right. Oh, my God. Does she have, like, an unlimited number of soldiers at her disposal? Oh, oh, oh. Oh, no, no, no. What, well, I'm war? Are we the people behind us? And... That should strip her armor a little. What the... Are you guys... having trouble on down here, I guess? Oh, of course you are! Trying out loud, guys. Can't get a lock. Lost you. God, why can't you target? Why? All right, all right, we gotta get her. Uh, okay, I'm going to. Whoa, okay. Taking med chill. Are they behind us already? Because they probably are. Okay. She's close to having no armor. Right, she's got no armor. Oh, God. I knocked her into the middle of wherever that is. Nice with the Tarzan impressions. Okay. Uh, uh, we, need to, we, need to, we need to get her. her, 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 her. Oh, fuck. I'm trying out loud. All right. I'm going to take care of that one. Whoa. Oh, God. God. New. Get. Oh, uh, more. Yeah, I'm warped now. God damn. Get away from... Me! Can I get her? I did! I got her! What the? Uh, oh, for the. the mirror. Is she still alive? Where it. Oh, for crying out. I don't have any more! Why can't I get a lock? Why can't I get an actual lock? Okay, we have to do this quickly by the looks of things. Okay. Let's. Yeah, we're helping the. Okay, okay, okay. Come on. Oh, okay, we want to be... And... Oh, God, is there more of them coming from there? Probably. Whoa, okay, okay, okay. Have we got more coming through? Move up! Oh. Whoa! Oh, why not? What? what? Okay, okay. I'll put them down. What the... What the actual... Okay. Is everyone down? What? what? Why can't I not aim at those guys? Someone coming behind us? Probably toxic warning. Yeah, I got it. I got it. I'm trying to stay out of the toxic stuff. Easier said than done. Oh my god. No, 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 no. Take what? Oh, I don't have med gel. I don't have med gel. I do not have med gel. All right. I can't. I can't see bloody anything. All right. Okay. Nice. I'm going to take that one out. And then relocate. Oh, God, no, I'm not. Oh, she's almost. 
she's dead. She's dead. She's dead. I'm not happy, but she's dead. Okay, please tell me what am I? Some record of that ship must be around here. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I think I see a data pad. I think I see a data pad. All right. Are we still hearing doors? All right. No. Could we just grab the data pad and run? All right, what up? What's this? Eclipse terminal. Yeah, let's... Yeah, whatever's on here as well, and was it no green and purple, green and there we go. <sighs> okay, I think this is what we're looking for. There's a just a car here, probably looking for the one we sent off to the AML. Dementa. I was happy to see her go. She chilled me to the bone. I just hope this just a card doesn't mess up my operation. That the ship the crazy Asari wanted to find? Should we head back to the police station and give her the name or look around first? Uh, we're looking around. We've got time. Let's look around some more. Assuming there's no one else trying to shoot at us. Wanna make sure there's no other incriminating evidence. Or money with which to purchase things like upgrades and fish. Back to the spaceport. Let's go. Okay, right. Spaceport of fish. Pitney or Nifty! I'm actually glad you made it. I don't know what they put in me, but I thought I was... Well, you saw. Anyway, thank you, Shepard. Uh, no problem. You are in so much trouble, Sunshine. Okay. Detective. If you have something that'll encourage the Justicar to leave, show it to her. I do. I've got something for you as well. Okay, you just want me to deal with this issue first. I understand. I've got the name of the ship. Your fugitive left here two days ago on the AML Demeter. Shepard, you impress me. You fulfilled your part of the bargain, and I will fulfill mine. I am ready to leave immediately, if that will satisfy your superiors, Detective. You're free to go, Justicar. It has been an honor having you in my station. And it's nice you didn't kill me, too. I expect you to follow orders. I have a feeling that's... Oh, is that going to be a problem? No, 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 no. Let's not start this relationship off by uh, talking down to her. The Normandy is docked near the main trading floor. I'll see you aboard. I must be sworn to your service so that I am never forced to choose between your orders and the code. Okay. And this is a big deal. By the code, I will serve you, Shepard. Your choices are my choices. Your morals are my morals. Your wishes are my code. I never thought I'd see a Justicar swear an oath like that. If you make me do anything extremely dishonorable, I may need to kill you when I'm released from my oath. <laughs> Right. So basically, you will do what I say, but at the end of it all, if you decide what I said was wrong, I'm dead. Got it. Ah. Uh... I can see that this is a very important act, Samara. Thank you. Truly, the life of a Justicar can get lonely. I admit I am looking forward to serving with a company of honorable heroes. Shall we return to your ship? No. Not yet. I have business with Anaya. I, I, I have business with Anaya. I do. 
I need to speak to the detective. Preferably. Thanks for getting Samara out of my district. I can tell my granddaughters about meeting a Justicar, and you've just upped my chances of living long enough to have grandkids. Okay, I, f I did your job for you. Now, I found the murderer. I have proof that Eclipse killed the Volus merchant. Let's see what you got there. Interesting, but I can't verify it. It would be inadmissible. I vouch for Shepard and any evidence he brings forward. I accept the judgment of the Justicar. Thanks, Shepard. I wasn't sure about trusting a stranger, and a human at that. But you came through. Never heard of this Elnora. Sounds like she was just starting her career. Good thing you cut it short. Okay, enough with all the congratulations. I've still got a spiraling crime rate. Eh, uh, return to the room. No, no, no. Uh, Pitney Four is a smuggler. I have proof that Pitney Four smuggled in red sand and illegal weapons tech. I'll send in some officers to arrest him and his cohorts. This is a big help, Shepard. I can't do much to thank you, but we do have a small discretionary bounty fund. Take this. Okay. Well, thank you very much. I'll be on my way. Be well. Value the Justicar. I've never heard of one working with a human before. Right. Yeah. And she's looking forward to serving with honorable heroes. You get that, guys? Honorable heroes. Grunt. I'm still grounded. What's going on? Nothing good, my friend. Nothing good. Welcome to the Normandy, Samara. We've studied your profile extensively. With your skills, I think you'll be an excellent addition to our team. Thank you. From an organization such as yours, that is high praise indeed. You approve of Cerberus? Okay, we need... I guess the, you're just talking about competence. We need her. Uh, okay. Just. I've seen Samara's biotic powers at work. They're substantial. We still don't know what we're going to find when we hit the collectors. I will be prepared for whatever we encounter. Where shall we put you? A room that looks out on the great empty void would be most comforting. Put her in the observation room on deck three. Thank you. I must meditate on the day's events. Deck three. Yeah, that's probably wise. Keep it away from Jack. Can't imagine those two are going to get along. Although, stranger things have happened. It was here, yeah? Yes. I just wanted to come and check that the quarters were acceptable. A little sparse, but... Okay. Um, just... Shepard. How are you? I've spent much of the last 400 years on my own. It is nice to have a colleague to chat with. I may be rusty at it, however. If you are patient, I would love to talk. I'm very patient. I'm not that patient, to be honest. I'm going to be completely honest with you. I am known for being somewhat impatient at times, but I will try. How much do you know about our mission? I know that I've sworn an oath to follow you and that you seek to destroy the Collectors. That is enough for me. You don't want to know why the Collectors need to be fought? When you live by a code that compels you to harsh action, you learn the dangers of curiosity. If I must kill a man because he has done wrong, do I really wish to know that he is a devoted father? Hmm. I guess it makes it easier, but... Is that the right way to look at it? I'd like to hear more about the criminal you were chasing on Nos Astra. I hope you will understand if I wish to avoid this topic. It is deeply tied to my code and beliefs. Uh, could, you might say it is personal. Could affect the mission. No, 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 that's the, I'll leave that for you to decide. What do you think of Cerberus? I've heard rumors, 
but learned long ago to form my own impressions. There is too much room for interpretation in the opinions of others. Okay. Why were you willing to work for Cerberus when you didn't have first-hand knowledge? I work for you, Shepard. Our methods may be different, but our goals are not. Okay. Alright, well... Alright, fair enough. I should get back to work. It has been my pleasure, Commander. Yeah. Oh, actually, before I go, before I go. Right, yes, um... Out of curiosity, well, you've probably not really spoken to them much. Just wondering... Shepard. Do you have any suggestions about using some of the resources we've gathered? I believe I can use some of them to increase our fuel reserves so we can explore further. Shall I tell you what is required? Oh, yeah, definitely. Definitely. Show me what it would take. Uh... Extended fuel cells. Normandy now has 50% fuel cell capacity. Engine refitted with Heed Industry Designed Helios Thruster Module. I have no idea what that is. Pretty sure Joker will be happy. So, Commander, even your Asari are trained killers? Get everyone at the same store or something? Right. But it's kind of what we need, really. And you should have seen her. She was pretty impressive, actually. Got any messages? Guardian Angels from Oriana Lawson. I hope this is the right Commander Shepard. I'm Oriana. My sister only told me a little, but I don't think it occurred to her that I'm as smart as she is. I poked around a little and found an information broker who got me this address. I got to thank her, but I never got to thank you for helping me. My parents don't really understand it, but I know how much Miranda did. How many little things over the years were her looking out for me. I'm not going to tell them. I still want to go to school and get some degrees, but I wanted you to know that I know you saved me. I had a guardian angel all these years. I don't know if my sister has anybody. She said she's working for you, and it was pretty clear you were doing something dangerous. Make sure she comes back alive, okay? Oriana. P.S. Don't tell her I sent you this. It would just make her angry. P.P.S. Miranda, quit looking at Shepard's messages. Oh, don't act like you don't. It's what I do. Miranda's looking at my messages. Of course she is. So's the elusive man, and probably everyone else. Commander, you've received a new message at your private terminal. No, I know, I've just... just read them. How are things? I had a wonderful chat with your friend Tally. She's not what I expected from her psych report. I like her. Yeah, she's not my friend. Of course, she's my friend. Tally's a good friend. We've been through a lot together. My female intuition says she wants to be more than just good friends. Uh, I, uh, wh why? What? What makes you say that? It's in her body language. How she turns to you when you enter the room. How she watches your every move. Uh, okay, I got it. Anyway, how may I help you, Commander? You could stop terrifying me for a start. Is there anything I should know? Nothing right now. Anything else, Commander? No. That'll be all. Yes, Commander. I'm going to be more careful talking to you from now on, that's for sure. Right, okay, so. We're... Out of curiosity, how much fuel can we now... To, oh, we can take a bit more, actually. Oh, we got some money. We might be able to buy some of the um, damage upgrades. We still haven't checked this system, actually, for resources. However, we've still got to recruit an assassin and check in with Liara and see if she's got a plan sorted out. I think I'll look for the assassin first. I figure if Liara had already completed her preparation, she would have contacted me. So we'll give her a little bit more time. It actually wouldn't matter either way. I'm thinking I want to take our newest crew member out. But I'm also thinking we do seem to be coming across quite a lot of biotics, quite a few people with barriers. So whilst it is nice to have someone who can strip down shields, I can now do that. Miranda can do that too. And she's got war, which is good against biotics. So we're going out with quite a lot of biotics. Seems like a sensible idea. 
I'm very close to being able to master energy drain. Miranda. All right, slam. Lifts the target and slams them down to the ground. I mean, you know, a bit of, bit of damage is always nice. I just, I feel like warp and overload are just, if, if, she's, if she's ready to fire something, I want one of those almost every time. However, I can't take this yet anyway, so it doesn't make much difference. Right, what do Justicars have? They have throw, hurls enemies through the air using a powerful biotic field. Pull. Now, this would mix well with Miranda's war. All right, so she's just basically going to be throwing people around. Recharge nine seconds. Honestly, though, is throw going to be more useful than pull? Asari, just a car. Ooh. Yeah. I think that power recharge is where it's at. Reeve biotically attacks the target's nervous or synthetic system and disables health regeneration. Wait a minute, so this damages shields and barrier? Used against organics, the field regenerates the biotic's health and provides a temporary health bonus? Reeve does double damage to armor and barriers. So this is good against armor and barriers, but it did say against synthetic systems, not necessarily shields. Shame. Not really an issue at the moment. All right, well, we definitely want to unlock pull. And I do think I want to master the just... Right, yeah, let's just get pull and then... More health, more damage. Quicker powers. Always good. Quicker powers. And then finally, Sapiens Justicar. Increase Samara's biotic abilities, further reducing the recharge time of her powers, or increase her weapon damage. Gotta be, got to be biotic abilities. Sapiens Justicar. The difference is... It's not huge, but 25% power recharge time. That's going to be nice. More lift, more throw. And uh, then we can warp and get those explosions going. So then, that is the next question. Do I want to master throw so she could... I like the idea of throwing. I, I will admit, it does sound kind of fun pushing people around and away, but pulling them up is just... Just as good. Maybe with throw, we could launch them off a ledge, but with pull, you get them up, they could be shot easily and warped. So yes, that's where we're going. We're definitely... And do we want a heavy pull? Recharge nine. Duration. It's just, it's just more duration. Now, nah, let's do pull field. All right, so we've now got someone who's a master of pulling and throwing people around. And someone who's pretty good at, well, detonating that particular biotic ability with their unstable warp and stripping shields. Good combo, actually. Oh! And before I forget, I definitely want to change... My my shotgun, the assault shotgun, an elite military shotgun capable of rapid fire. This weapon is deadly at short range, but ineffective at long range. Yeah. Effective against shields and biotic barriers, but weak against armor. No, no. I mean, the claymore was effective against armor, shields, and biotics, but not good at long range. The eviscerator... It, yes, it's got, um, the M22 shaves off serrated metal wedges designed to fly aerodynamically, which d dyn dramatically improves its armor-piercing capabilities and makes it better at longer ranges. So it's, it's good against armor, shields, and good at long range. I just, I like the Eviscerator. Couldn't quite get the hanger there. It fires like a normal shotgun, but if you hold the trigger down... It'll do 
a longer range projectile, I probably should try. You know what? Let's give it another try. Let's not use this unless we absolutely have to. Okay, and Samara Locus, yeah, collector assault rifle. Eee. You know what? No, take 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 the heavy rifle. I think. Okay, we're ready. Excuse me, my sources indicate you were in a warehouse recently. Did you by any chance forward a questionable shipping note to a Mr. Thax? Yes. Yes, I did. It looked suspicious, so I passed it on. I'm a representative for Mr. Thax. He's very grateful to you. Please accept this as a gift for bringing the shipping irregularities to his attention. What is Mr. Thax going to do? What happens to the shipping agent who is cheating Thax? That depends on how sincere her apology is and how willing she is to correct her mistake. Got a feeling I know who it is. Got a feeling I don't necessarily want to help. Yeah. Happy to help. Yeah, bye -bye. It was my pleasure. Totally. Have a pleasant day. Very, very unlikely. I am unable to find much information about Thane Krios. He is understandably difficult to locate. Your former teammate, Liara Tassoni, may have more information. Her office overlooks the trading floor. Did we forget to mention to Edie that we already know where to find him? We probably should pass that sort of information on to her. She was right there, yeah. Serena? Who wants to know? Show some respect. Now, you know what? I know what it's like to be typing something and someone just interrupts you and expects you to look up mid-sentence. Don't like the way she Ask that question, but still, let's just keep it cordial. Name Shepard. Liara Tassoni said you might have information on Thane Krios. Tana, cover for me. Over here. Yeah, I know who Thane Krios is. I might have passed him some information, but I didn't hire him. What do you want to know? So you know he's an assassin. So you know he's an assassin, and you gave him information. I mean, I appreciate I'm actually here to recruit him, not, you know, take him out. But that's because I'm trying to save the galaxy and I could do with someone with his skill set. But he is here to kill someone who is technically a civilian, yeah? Just tell me what you know about him. I ran security for Nasana Dantius. Then I found out she was having people killed to cover up her dirty secrets. She fired me when I confronted okay. her. Her loss. I might have been good enough to stop Thane from taking her down. Yeah, that makes me feel a little better, actually. This is, I mean, to be honest with you, let's face it, every time we meet someone in a place like this, I probably, I've got like a 50-50 chance I'm going to end up shooting them. So I suppose I shouldn't really even care about an assassin here. Why does that name sound familiar? She was a representative on the Citadel a few years ago. Right. She had me kill her sister, the slaver. Her! <gasps> I thought that was just a rumor. I well, remember! You know what she's capable of then. She has even more power here in Nos Astra. She uses it to keep her friends in check, and her enemies dead. Wait, wait, I didn't kill her sister for her. He says, realizing there's a Justicar right behind him. I did not! I did not! I technically killed her sister because her sister was a criminal who tried to attack me. I then passed on the news to Nasara, and she seemed happy about it, but I did not kill her sister border. I realize I sound like I'm denying it a little too strongly, but it's because it's true. Killed a lot of people. I have never killed anyone just because someone paid me to do it. If you work there, you must have an idea what his opposition will be. Eclipse Mercs. High-tech killer. Undisciplined, but very well equipped. Okay. They don't much care who they kill, as long as they're paid for it. Thane has quite a reception waiting for him. I told him all I knew. He didn't seem worried. You know, I'm starting to like him more and more. Okay. 
All right, fair enough. So there's an assassin here to kill Eclipse Mercs and a terrible person. Huh? So where do I find Thane? The Dantius Towers, penthouse level of Tower One. There's a second tower, still under construction. If Thane is smart, he'll go in from there. And he has access? It doesn't sound like Nasana's just gonna let me in. She's as smart as she is paranoid. No one's getting in or out of there without a fight. I can get you in, but you'll only get one shot. You'd better be ready. I mean, I get... Why would you be so willing to help me? I get why you want the assassin to go over there and kill her, but... You're just offering your help? No strings attached? You're going to look for Thane. Nasana's mercenaries will try to stop you. At the least, you'll distract her guards. Take a little fire, give Thane a clear shot. I didn't hire him to kill Nasana, but I won't shed any tears when she gets what's coming to her. Wow. Definitely, definitely wouldn't want to be you right now with Samara glaring at you like that. Just saying. Do you know anything else about Thane? Not much. He did say that he's not doing the hit for money. Nobody hired him. I wanted to know who I was helping, and he said he's doing this job on his own. Oh. That he had to restore the balance of his life. I don't know. Maybe he's crazy. If he takes down Nasana, I don't care why he does it. So he's gone vigilante now. He's out. He's, is he doing a Garrus? Huh. Okay. Right, yeah, no, we're, we're ready. Let's go. Let's go then. Good. I'm tired of this crap. We'll go tonight as soon as the shift workers clear out of Tower 2. She is like stone cold about this. I've tempted to recruit her.